what's happening y'all this right here is a yosemite slash tahoe trip we didn't actually make it to yosemite because because of covid you now need reservations to even go there so we went there was denied and then we went to a, a lake right next to it paddle boarded my friend kayaked and then we went to tahoe and was on the lake most of the morning and came back yesterday so yeah it was a great trip this is a video of the adventures this is true your boy true hope y'all enjoy There's no trespassing. We can. I've never seen a dam like this in my life. So right here we're at Don Pedro Lake. As you can see, I'm getting ready to do the, the true dip. Let's watch. So yeah, this is the first lake uh, after Yosemite. Uh, when we was told we can't go into Yosemite, we turned back around. This is the first lake we got to, Don Pedro, and we had a pretty good time. The water is very murky and it's very rocky, so you can't really see in the water, or see through the water, but it still was a pretty good lake. The water is pretty warm and like I said, it was, it was a pretty good time. The wind did kick in hard. So yeah, it got pretty windy out there. Um, like I said, the water is really murky, but we had a great time as you can see how murky the water is underwater. I'm actually swimming underwater. You can barely see me. The camera's pointing at me. And here's a better, that's probably the best area we got. But yeah, it was a good time. We are currently here in We're in Lake Tahoe. Hey, excuse me. Restrooms? Restrooms? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry. Thanks. Yeah. Mom Blue. South Lake Tahoe. It's good to be here. I just realized I don't have my hat on. <laughs> That's that bullshit. So yeah, it's good they were going to car because I need my hat. Huh? What? All the food places? No, I think I think uh, Hard Rock has some places open. Yeah. This place right here, Hard Rock Casino, has stories with me. <laughs> Holy shit. Tahoe has stories with me. <laughs> New Year's has never been the same. So right here is a sunrise in Tahoe. Um, I woke up around 5 in the morning, 5, 5 15 ish. And I decided to get up and go to the waterfall, Eagles Waterfall, and catch the sunrise. Um, it, the weather was so amazing. It felt like I was back in the Bay Area. Good 50, 50 degrees, I want to say. It didn't hit the 60s till after the sun came up, but it, it felt amazing. And just getting the pictures and everything before the sun hits, before the sun came over the mountains, just get the pictures and just to soak in the, the beauty of nature right before the sun hit was absolutely amazing as you guys see this this is this is just stuff i love doing look at that just just seeing the water orangish it's like you're almost it's like you're watching the sunset at the ocean the except it's rising up. and me personally i've rarely ever seen a sun rise over the ocean i live here in california so to see the sunrise and see how it hits the water was just absolutely amazing and 
I'll let you guys just see the video and maybe I, I'm not sure how, how the volume is on the video, but hopefully you guys can enjoy it. Look at that sun sunrise right there. The sunrise right over the mountains. I grew up with it. I, I, there's, I can't explain it how many times I still love seeing it after 30 plus years. California is such a beautiful state when you go visit it. This is Lake Tahoe, that is Eagle Falls, Lake Tahoe off Highway 89. I grew up coming here and just to be able to film it and record it and to continue to experience it is absolutely amazing. Before I finish this up, just to let you know, everything I'm recording on my phone is a front camera because I broke my back camera in the Ford Keys. The ocean just took it out, so this is what you get, front face All camera. Right. But I About still time to get ready to get I'm on the water. Proud I got it, at least filmed. So not yet. Front two, free, front, right the two, two things I'm using is my phone, and then I'm also using my Action Pro camera. It's not a GoPro, but it's still got what I needed. So here we are. This is the first time I'm actually hitting the water in Lake Tahoe. Um, I swam in it before, but I've never actually been out of shore. Like, you know, basically gone out on paddleboard, jet ski boat. So here I am paddleboarding um, Lake Tahoe, and I, the water is just so blue and so clear. It's, absolutely amazing this is probably around seven o'clock in the morning um right when the park opened we was one of the first ones at the park and just inflated everything up and hit the water and wow tahoe is a place that everybody needs to experience everybody also needs to you know hit the water and just see how amazing the the rocks are underneath, how clear it is, and I'm not gonna lie, the water is pretty cold, but when you jump in that water, it's so refreshing. You're, you want to see me do a, do a true dip later on in the video, but just just enjoy the, the scenery and God's beauty of nature.
So recording this video, I actually had no idea that red mark was there. Um, this is technically I was using Snapchat. I want to show people a Snapchat what what was going on, what I was up to, and like I said, I was enjoying every bit of it. You know, just recording, paddling, and enjoying. Didn't even pay attention with the red mark on the screen, <clears throat> but. It was still a great time.
So right here, I had to turn the volume down for some reason on the Action Pro. Everything was just louder and more intensified. So I turned the volume down, but looking at the rocks and you know, just the shape of the rocks from the water and that there's a few little caves that I, I, I came across, but couldn't really get in because like there's one, the rock formation was just stopping us from entering but it was absolutely amazing. And then just looking through the water and I believe I adjust the camera so I can aim down in the water so you can see the different, the different shades of blue. And um, it, it was just absolutely breathtaking, amazing. I cannot wait to come back to Tahoe again. This next time I wanna hit, you know, Emory, uh, Emory Bay and then up north at Kings Beach. Those are definitely two places I really want to hit. Right now we're at Tahoe's or uh, Paradise Tahoe, um, which is just absolutely incredible. I mean, like I said, we're, we're out here around seven, eight o'clock in the morning now. This is probably around 7.30, 7.45 in the morning. And the water is still just calm. There's not a lot of boat traffic jet ski traffic there's not a lot of tourist track traffic which was absolutely amazing so the water was flat sometimes the water got glassy um here and there we saw a few people wakeboarding which you know created wake but it was absolutely amazing at this time in the morning um we was probably out in the water till i want to say around 10 almost 11 o'clock in, in the morning which was absolutely great like when you're out in the water you just lose track of time and that's exactly what we did lose track of time this water is cold so right here brandon this is brandon's recording from his phone he uh recorded some the people that passed us earlier they was i guess trying to do yoga on the paddle boards and i mean i didn't see it but it looks like they was having a good time uh the parents and i want to say it was two sisters uh, we, I talked to him earlier. Um, Brandon wasn't around. I didn't record our conversation, but I talked to him earlier, and they seemed like amazing people. I'm telling you, the paddleboard and kayak community is just absolutely wonderful, and I love being a part of it now. As as you see, Brandon's just recording them, um, having a good time at the lake. Everybody's having a good time. That's what we do. And yeah. <laughs> So right here, we're almost back to where we dropped everything off at. I'm about a football field, maybe a football field length away from shore, I'm about 100 yards, um, maybe 50, 40, 50 yards from the from the rocks. And I'm just relaxing, thinking about hitting the water. Um, this water just is so beautiful. This is around 11 p.m. And yeah, I'm thinking about hitting the water. Um, yeah, right here. You know, looking into doing a true dip, and here it goes. Just look how clear that water is. It's all different shades of blue. It's 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 so amazing. It's so it's incredible. And that water is cold. I will tell you that, but it was still worth it. Jumping in there and doing a true dip. Alright y'all, about to leave Tahoe, head back to the house, back to reality. Deuce.